That blaring siren salute for the real heroes in this coronavirus crisis, the doctors and nurses making the shift change at a SoCal hospital. Well, that greeted them as they came in for another long shift in what could be an exhausting night of work. That's right. KCAL Line's Christy Fajardo reports tonight from Covina. For once, sirens were a welcome sound at Emanate Health Intercommunity Hospital. You could make out the smiles behind the masks. We love you, Daddy. As Covina police and LA County Fire filed by at shift change. A black and white and red thank you to exhausted hospital workers. It's nice to know you're not alone and that the work you're doing, which we do from the heart, but that it's appreciated by our partners out there. They're on the front line as much as we are. Four weeks, the hospital has seen dozens of COVID-19 patients. Tents are set up in the parking lot for the overflow. That's why one act of solidarity drew nurses, doctors, assistants, and more out of the ER with cell phones in hand. It tugs at your heartstrings, uh, especially at the end of the, the shift when you go home to join your family. But, uh, you know, having, you know, have the support of our community, it just feels great. We're concerned about each other and concerned about what we take home. And so we're really focused on making sure that everybody's protected. An acknowledgement from those who risk their lives that hospital workers are now risking theirs. I want to say thank you to them. Um, you know, they say that uh, God created nurses so uh, police officers and firemen could have heroes. And these days, there's no question heroes wear scrubs. And displays of gratitude are pouring in when a simple thank you just doesn't feel like enough. The numbers are constantly changing. The staff here tells me they are testing about 10 people a day, and they currently have about five people hospitalized with COVID-19. And they say all of the offers of food, masks, and help from the public is really helping to boost morale. In Covina, Chrissy Fajardo, KCAL 9 News.